Hi guys, it's Jen here and welcome to Jen's Wild About Art. So today I'm going to draw a picture of a lionfish for you. Um, I'm going in with my mechanical pencil first and doing this outline and I got this reference picture off Unsplash, uh, which is a um, royalty free photograph reference site. So I'm just drawing in his basic outline now and then I'll just define his fins a little bit more because he's got spines all around. They're the most magnificent looking fish. So yeah, I'll just go in and I'll continue on and finish off the outline with my mechanical pencil. Then I will go over it with my micron pens and get the outline filled in. So I'm drawing in all the lines around his body, I'm just defining the spikes on his fins and drawing the lines around everywhere and yeah I'll just continue adding these lines and details around uh, his body and his tail and when I've finished uh, lining him with my micron pens I'll go in with my pit pens and fill him with colour and that'll give him lots of uh, dimension and yeah, make him look a lot more realistic. So now I'm happy with the drawing, so I'm going around all the line work with my 0 0.003 micron, which is the finest micron I have, and I'm erasing the, the pencil lines as I go.
So now I'm starting to fill in his um, colours on his on his skin, and I'm adding skin tones, um, very pale skin tones for the first layer around all of his lines and his stripes. starting to fill in between some of the lines now with the pale grey and I'm using that in the shadow areas so anywhere that does have shadow around the fish I will fill in with this pale grey. So now I start working on the fish's body and his fins and I start working in with various red browns and browns to build up uh, the colour on his lines and on his fins on his body and I'll work them up from lightest to darkest as I go and end up doing the darkest shadows in the darkest colours around the base of his fins and the bottom of his body but you'll see yeah, I build up the layers with all the browns first and get the textures and the tones where I want them. So now I'm working around again with a very pale indigo and going back into the shadow areas and building up a bluey sort of a colour for the shadows and around the fins and the tail. Now I'm 
going in and I'm adding a little bit of ivory around certain areas, sort of just little touches here and there around the tips of his fin, the bottom of his chin. And then I go back in and work in again with all the darker browns and a nougat colour and start to deepen up the darkest areas. Now I'm going around and I'm adding ice blue just around everywhere that I've added that grey and that pale blue I'm now adding this ice blue it's a slightly stronger colour just to define those areas a little bit more. Now I'm going around and just adding in some warmer colours. I'll go through from oranges to deep reds and that will really make his colour pop and these lines really stand out. Uh, yeah, it's lots of fun adding these warmer tones to this fish. I think he's, he's coming along beautifully. Thanks so much for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this video I'd love it if you click like and subscribe and on the bell icon that way you'll be notified when I release a new video I'll also pop the links below to my twitch channel where the full two and a half hour video of me drawing this fish is um, yeah anyway thanks so much for watching guys have an awesome day and I'll see you next video okie doke bye